Ouais. This does not look like the last story. <laughs> There's multiple endings in this one. What? During summer holiday, I barely managed to arrange for all the girls I met to meet. Wait, during summer holiday, during summer holiday, I barely managed to arrange for all the girls to meet. The girls I met to meet at the. What? No, 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 no. During summer holidays, <laughs> during summer holidays, I barely managed to uh, arrange for all the girls I met to meet at the onsen, onsen, okay, and have a good time. Haruka agreed instantly, so I didn't even have to use all my macho tricks to convince her. The sisters, however, were more difficult. After the incident at their house, Anko treated me with uh, apprehension and hesitation to go anywhere. True. So I decided. Uh, so I decided a bit of cheating was in order. I turned directly to Yukari. Luckily, she was ready for a trip for fun and bathing. And once Yukari took the bait, Anko was eager to join. But the hardest yet was Anna. Not only did she avoid my calls, but completely avoid me. Maybe she forgot about our secret agreement, but I remember that Anna was also fairly close to Yukari. All it took was some convincing for her to find, uh, to, blah, blah, for her friend and Anna, convincing for her friend and Anna, unable to resist her friend's infectious energy, uh, was also on board. Okay, once the group was ready, I had yet another obstacle. I had no idea how we even get there. Trains were expensive. Taxis were just as pricey and busy and buses didn't uh, even stop there but thankfully Anna surprised me again actually she surprised everyone the wealthy spoiled and cold lady knew how to drive a car and she had one it was a little hard to believe I thought ladies her uh, ladies like her never had to bother with those kinds of things didn't servants do the driving while she went shopping or to school or whatever she wanted yet <clears throat> once she got behind the wheel she actually drove quite confidently it was a welcome surprise to know she's at least did a few things for herself Uncle, are you okay it, yeah i'm uh, all right just a little nauseous are you sure do you need a barf bag uh, no. Are we there yet? Hmm. According to the map, we're close. Just need to turn left here. You're looking at the map upside down. Oh, really? <laughs> anyway, it still shouldn't take long. <laughs> You're looking at the map upside down. <laughs> what? <laughs> I still shouldn't take long, even though I'm looking at the map upside down. <laughs> what? Have been there by now if someone hadn't chosen such an unpopular place. Uh, someone. But, but who? who? Yeah, who? Who are you talking about here? <sighs> yeah, silence. Yeah, silence. Who? Really, Yukari, why did you choose such a place? M me? But I thought you did. What? <laughs> I did. Oh, but it's so beautiful and there's delicious food. There has to be, uh, this has to be the best uh, onsen in the whole world. You've never actually been there before, have you? Uh, 
Um, in my childhood, I think still, I'm sure it's simply Great. gorgeous. This should be fun. I hope so, Anna. Anna. Stop the car now! Oh no! Please don't stay in my seats. <coughs> I think I feel sick now too. Oh god. Yeah, me oh too. Oh god. How did I get myself into this? Well, you're a pantsu hunter. Comes with the job. Finally, we arrived. Stepping out of the car, we all breathe deeply of the fresh mountain air. Yukari, you might not want to write this in your diary. This is definitely not a story you want to remember. Yeah, I think I agree with you. Why not? Can I just go to the room? I really <sighs> want to sleep. Me too. I'll go with you. Thank God. Yukari. Do you want to share a room with me tonight? Do you want to steal her panty? Steal what? <laughs> just a perm. Don't mind him. But he feels sick. Why'd you hit him like that? Yeah, why would you do that, Anna? Anna? It's all right. It happens. Well, we have a boy. These bags are yours. I'm out. Well, I'm not sleeping with a boy. These bags are yours. I'm out. What? Do you need help? You don't look well. She's extremely embarrassed, and blushed the color of Japanese carps. Aw. Um. Sure. Do you think you can end up well, I think it's far too difficult for you in your condition. Well, here's the bag. Well, it's a little heavy. Hmm, but I just gave her a small bag with some clothes. Are you sure you can handle yep, it? I got it. Okay then. I guess we can go yep. now. I'm so glad we're finally here. Uh I kept thinking I might die. Sorry for making you girls sick. You're a tough one, Yukari. <laughs> Probably. Well, this is a rather modest, modest place. Doesn't anyone dust around here? As it turned out, we were all alone at. The, at the onsen not a guest in sight except for the, an old man who actually turned out to be the manager still the place was awesome and I felt the power of my young of my young returning I think he meant youth the power of my young returning the power of my youth returning I forgot to ask uh, for the location of my room but there weren't many options in such a small place it had to be behind one of these doors. I could just ask, but I'll just take a look around. Can't be that hard. Sure, let's try this one. Uh, thank God I can finally get rid of these bags. Don't realize energy uh, worked immediately. Hell, I forgot. I felt. Well, I forgot. I felt so car sick earlier. This is truly paradise. I'm surrounded by four gorgeous ladies, and this is the perfect opportunity to snatch all their panties. Who knows? Wait, yeah, who knows? Maybe another thing could happen here too. If the powers go out, they could be frightened and want to sleep uh, in my protective arms. Uh, the thought warms my cold, miserable soul. <laughs> this is truly a dream come true. Then. A really loud bang interrupted my thoughts. Anko broke into the room loudly. Hey, where's all the stuff? You were supposed to drop off the bags. I felt sick 
and you left me there to suffer. Serves you right. Who cares about your sad sob story? I just want the best. <clears throat> Careful. Careful in Foxy, Haruka appeared behind Uncle, Anko. You're just being rude. But really, where are our panties? What? Panties? In this bag? Oh no, I screwed up. All this time the panties were in this bag right under my nose and I blew my chance to take them <laughs> by daydreaming. I'm so stupid. They're all in this bag right here, but I have to ask, why in the hell is it so heavy? What do you have uh, what do you have there? What do you have there? It's what do you have in there? But okay. What do you have there? Underwear with iron spikes? What are you doing? BDS? <laughs> BDSM? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Me. Do you want to take a peek? No! He's not peeking at anything. Let's get away from this jerk. I'm a jerk? Hey, I was just curious. I didn't even ask to peek. Catch you later. Well, just my luck. I regret the loss. Uh, I regret the loss for the rest of the day. I quickly changed into something relaxing and enjoyed a glass of orange drink. Alas, but there were no traditional kimonos here. I bet they would have sat on. What? I bet they would have sat on me perfectly, especially on the girls. I guess this is just a slang. Yeah, maybe just it's just me. Of course, they needed more time to perfect their outfits and touch up their hairs and makeup. Uh, it was a wait, but totally worth it to see them so to see them so beautiful. Anko appeared first, despite her tomboyish nature and uh. An abundance of guy friends and her tendency to be quite rude she had a very feminine physique gosh what a you cutie so? it's scary to hear such a question from Anko <laughs> hey I know I know beauty when I see it where's you car <laughs> that's so fucked up you can't <laughs> I know beauty when I see it. Where's your sister? <laughs> Whoa! I just missed a lot of stuff. Can I go back? <laughs> no! <laughs> just gotta have to get through all of this. Look, we'll do the other routes later, but we just have to get back to the route. We're <laughs> stop. Yeah, yeah, blah blah. We arrived. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, I can't believe you want to still paint it. Blah 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 blah. Don't mind him. Blah blah. blah. Do you want to take the bags? Blah blah blah. blah, blah. Look, look, uh, agreeable. Blah, blah. You can manage it here. Here's the bag. Uh, it's so heavy. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Walk faster. Ah, <laughs> uh, there's no one here except us and the manager. Blah 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 blah. I gotta find out which room is mine. Yeah, which one? I chose this one. I guess I correctly. Uh, I could have literally chose any of these rooms, and I I freaking chose the right room. And the fucking chances, right? Like the other plate though, we'll, we'll we'll go through the other rooms. Uh, bags, can't believe it. Blah 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 blah. Anko, we we're supposed to go. Where's our, where's our panties? Oh, uh, blah blah. blah. No. cheek, no, don't look. Uh, catch you later. Blah blah blah. Ha ha ha. He he he. Yeah yeah blah blah. Parent blah blah. Physique, good so? to kill anything. So blah blah. Yeah, where's your you sister? Have to find some things for Anna. Oh god. What are you doing after the onsen? Onsen. I bought a deck of cards, and the food here is delicious. So I thought we could kill some time like that before enjoying a yeah, walk. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Oh crap! I didn't bring a uh, football. What are you gonna do? <laughs> oh, shut up! After the uh, after the accident at the sister's house, Uncle continued to treat me badly, but now she looks relaxed and even laughing at my jokes. It gives me hope. Or perhaps something good happened. 
The silent lingered, both of us quiet. Usually she allowed usually she's loud and eager to converse, but instead she sips her drink without a word. Then Anna entered the room. It's impossible to describe her beauty. You just have to see it to understand. While wow, my cold hearted beauty may one so unworthy as I kiss your hand <laughs> what Anna hesitated only briefly before extending her hand and looking down at me with slight narrow eyes as possible she even sees me as a slave <laughs> maybe unwittingly I become one uh, such was the <coughs> 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 Oh my goodness, what such was the addiction of her beauty. Okay, that's enough. You're drooling on my skin. Um, would you kiss my hand too? Anka, whoa. Uh, why do you want me to kiss your hand? Can't you see it? It's obvious she's into you. No, I'm not. And fine, if that's how it is, I don't want him to kiss me. What? Why would you even act? This protagonist is so stupid. Who's kissing who? Does anyone want to kiss for me? Uh, hello? Me? I, I'll take... <laughs> oh, me, me. <laughs> you can kiss my hand, but stay away from him. Our Anko's a bit jealous. Anko? That's how you say her name? Anko? Not Anko? Anko? Okay. Alright. Okay. I am not. Just shut up already! Uh, totally unfair. Did something happen without me around? Come on, you have to fess up. Now I also want to kiss. No! Out of nowhere appear the slaughterhouse of a black cat? Okay. Silhouette. Silhouette of a black cat. I don't know why it's a slaughterhouse. What the hell? Out of nowhere appeared the uh, silhouette of a black cat. Yukari covered me with her graceful shadow and pulled a finger to Hikari's lips. I mean, yeah, not Hikari, wow, Haruka's lips. But why? Just keep calm, Haruka. Haruka. You're too young. Too young to kiss? That's just silly. How about you kiss me instead? What the fuck is going on? What is this trip? Haruka eyes flew open. Seems the power of youth drives everyone crazy. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, girls, the hot spring is ready for relaxing your tender young bodies. <laughs> what? Thanks. He's such a filthy old man. Is he your grandpa? He sounds as perverted as you. Wow, thanks, Anna. Oh. Yukari? Yeah. Why did she say it like that? It's Yukari, what? Are you wearing underwear? Yes. Why? Don't you know? He shouldn't wear underwear while visiting the onsen. What are you talking about? What? It's believed that if you wear <coughs> panties, your loved one won't even look at you. What, what the heck? No way I'll believe that. It's obscene. It's also kind of green, you know? It feels kind of good. Seems like panties should be a must-have. I've never heard of such a thing. Oh, she's just joking, right? What? Why are you asking me? What? Did I become more attractive to you? Wait, wait, wait. This. Are you not worried? She'll probably run off right now to take them off. <laughs> it's not true. Yes, it is. Tell her. <laughs> I'm gonna agree with Haruka. <laughs> Haruka's right. Underwear uh, confines us, and it's good to be more natural. Really? <laughs> That's exactly right. I knew you would understand. I should still give you a big kiss for that, but I'll leave it for later. Okay, Haruka. What is this? What is what is chapter three? <laughs> 
uncle sounded upset just now. Did I disappoint her? <coughs> no, she's more curious in uh, on the mystery of that. Harka, wait, Harka's uh, taken off already, and Yukari looks sad. Why does Yukari look sad? Okay, but I can't tell at who. Well, I'm not wearing any boxers, so yeah, I do. That's it. I'm out. <laughs> I go shouts and quickly disappears down the corridor. Well, you should really wear your boxers. It's ugly without them. <laughs> what? <laughs> After a nice conversation in the hall, the girls went into the hot springs, but I decided to grab some water to drink. Oh, Ow. sorry. She looked worried, but where could she be going so quick at such a time? Let me through. I need to make a call. I leaned aside and stepped out of her way before she quickly rushed past me and headed to her room. It's rather late. Maybe something happened to upset her. <coughs> ah. Here it is, a place of pure pleasure. Although, it can't uh, quite surpass the pleasure of panties. <laughs> the beautiful onsen will always be the second most uh, pleasuring thing in my life. The girls entered the hot spring first, but I didn't hear any of their chatter. If they went off somewhere, they'll be back. If I hide, they'll be completely unaware I'm around. It's the perfect chance to get a glimpse of their panties. Hey, is anyone here? Wait, what are you guys doing in there? What? They're competing to see who can hold their breath longest. Even you, Anna? You, Curry? Uh, so it is Anna, okay. Actually, we decided to drown ourselves before you arrive, so we don't have to tolerate your tricks. Wow. The one who wins gets to spend the night with him. What? Spend the night with him? Are you all crazy? <laughs> it's funny hearing that question come from you. It was a joke. Jeez, just relax. When did you learn to make jokes? And you, Anna, are you interested too? Not unless I was desperate. I'm just a gambler. So no. No need for that pervert. What happened in here? I was gone for maybe five minutes. You went to call someone. Probably your boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not telling any of you. Wow, apparently everything is all serious now. What is going on? <laughs> it's not. I'm not giving up the fight for. What? <laughs> what happened? Hold on, I gotta charge my phone. I gotta. <laughs> this is a completely different. I guess if I played the first girl, you guys would understand. This is this is a complete like 720, 180, 360, quadruple backflip like this. <laughs> this is some brand new, brand new. <laughs> and you, Anko, do you have a boyfriend? Mm, Anko. No. <laughs> She's always beating the boys at football. They're all too afraid to date her. But it's an excellent place to meet guys. <coughs> find one you like eventually. Wow. Just immediately pushing Anko off to some other guy. What if she did? What is this? I can't. I, look, the only reason I'm just stopping because I keep psychoanalyzing these characters. And I'm just like, this. what is this? What happened? When did this come to this? Well, they're fun to play with. I just don't think about guys that way. Well, that's boring. How about you, Yukari? Uh, okay, and you, Anna? Any boyfriends for you? No, I'm not interested in relationships. Well, I had a boyfriend once. 
when we broke up. Just don't ask how or why. Okay, I do know about this. Maybe we should play through the Haruka before... Mm, it's too late, kind of, really. But... If y'all want me to do the Haruka story, chapter one, um, I'll do that. Uh... <clears throat> just kind of found a lot of her stuff was interested in the new content that I didn't get to play through and like I said this game was like freezing a lot so I, I didn't want to risk playing through her stuff but it seems now they have to retry and the menu button and a whole bunch of other stuff when you white out instead of just whiting out so very very good improvement that they did to this game don't know when they did it but really 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 good okay don't worry none of us are going to well, I'm gonna ask about Anna and a cute little birthmark. Huh? Surprise, surprise. She's changing the subject. <laughs> Wait, does she really have a birthmark? A birthmark? You're just imagining things. No, you don't get to hide. Let us see. Hold her! Uh, hold her, wow. <laughs> Situation quickly spiraled out of control. No, let me go! Kyukari, help me! Yukari! I won, but I've always wanted to know. <laughs> no! You're such a betrayer. Oh no, a nosebleed. You must get out of here. <clears throat> Cause you want to see her birthmark? Well... It was getting a little too steamy for me to handle. There was only one drop of blood. <laughs> But I still thought it's best to get going. I hurt my feel. Hmm. <laughs> I could have walked through the old girl's room and looked for their panties, but it was so good in the hot springs, it was hard to find the energy to move. I wanted to lie on the soft bed and imagine Anko, Yukari, Anna, and Haruka in beautiful underwear. They were all desperate and happy to hold me. <laughs> What are you doing? <coughs> mm. Oh, nothing, obviously. Opening my eyes, I stared at Anna. Because it's not Anna, it's Anna. I stared at Anna. Who looked down at me with a uh, spring warm skin and a turban wrapped hair. Okay. <coughs> Why did you leave, uh, why did you leave the onsen so early? I could ask you the same question. True. I got overheated. The combination of the springs and you girls screaming about birthmarks almost did me in. Uh, so you heard. But I won't tell anyone about this. You don't have to worry. What about this birthmark of yours? God, you heard that too? They were just poking fun. Forget about it. <laughs> They annoyed me, so I left. Haruka even clung to my leg like a crazy woman. Do you even like it here? <clears throat> you always seemed annoyed. I hear that a lot. Well, often. It's who I am. Probably from childhood. I don't understand why I'm like this. But people keep sticking around. Hmm. It's hard for me to be around people. Everyone always wants something from you. Lately, even a glance at me has begun to strain me. I stopped enjoying everyone's attention. Especially annoying people. You know who I mean. It's so... Beautiful and refreshing. And I'm... Well, I'm happy to be here with everyone. Happy I met you guys. I'm happy I met you too. What about you? <coughs> you enjoy yourself? Of course. Because they're four girls next door. And they're panties, right? <laughs> Shh, not so loud. We'll get busted. Anna, I was wondering where you were. You just took off. Of course I did. You all had your hands all over me. Hey, not in front of the boys. Oh, him? Don't worry. 
He loves the stuff. Yes, yes, please keep talking. I'm all no ears. No way. I'll just tell you later. Later. Oh, girls, you can move those cute little buns into the hall. Dinner is served. Why does it sound like a chick? It doesn't sound like an old dude. Oh, boy. Not him again. Didn't even sound like a, a dude. I'll be in the bathroom. You cute little buns. <laughs> <clears throat> the table was filled with all kinds of food, most of which I couldn't name. Oh, that one looks like a stew, like a carrot and potato stew. That one looks like chicken. That one looks like ramen on the left, top left. That looks like shrimp. Like shrimp tempura on the top right. It looks like maybe like a curry on the bottom right. <coughs> Anna was missing uh, from the group, probably still in the bathroom. Haruka and Anko. Is it Anko? No, we found this. It's Anko? It's Anko. Not Anko. Anko. Harka and Anko were uh, looking at the food and whispered to each other for a while. While. F whis whispered to each other while Yukari uh, shook her head disapprovingly. I think it's too much. No, it's fine. Really. Don't be afraid, Yukari. <clears throat> Nothing's going to happen. What are you talking about? Look. Tell me. Opening her fist, Anko revealed a large, disgusting worm. Where did she get it? Where did she get something like that? Ugh, that still makes me sick. Please put it away. And why do you even have that? Just put it outside. Yeah, I agree. Jeez, that is totally disgusting. It won't suffer. Worms are quite tenacious. I'm just going to slip it in Anna's rice. She's been way too dense. Are you serious? Right now? Anna is going to kill It'll you. It'll be worth it to see her come out of her shell. <coughs> <coughs> wow, Anko. Turns out you are cruel. Warn uh, Anna about the worm. Keep silent. I'll keep silent. Well, here goes nothing. I guess I'm also a bit interested in pulling Anna from her sh uh, pulling Anna from her shell. It's difficult to get any emotions out of her. This sh should definitely work. Anna appeared in the door, but the room stayed silent and in my mind overly suspicious. She slipped into the open seat next to us. Everyone is here. Then let's eat. <sighs> Yeah, yeah. yeah. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. Anna sat like a queen. Her perfect posture reflecting a serious aristocrat. No, reflecting a real aristocrat. I can't like it. Just fucking. She uh, mentioned she didn't know how to use chopsticks, so they brought her a knife and fork instead. Uh, sticking a fork into rice, Anna brought uh, the food to her lip as the worm slipped out and squirmed back and forth as it suffocated from the lack of air. <coughs> sticking the fork into the rice, Anna brought the food to her lips as the worm slipped out and squirmed back and forth and suffocated from the lack of air. How dare you! Anka started to giggle. But Anna didn't appreciate this joke. Thank you for dinner. Standing, Uncle grabbed an untouched apple and walked away. 
the smallest faded from their faces as their guilt ate at them. I tried to warn you. Now look and see what happened over a stupid worm. I, I thought it would be fun. Well, her reaction was funny. But now, what do we do? Shouldn't we go and apologize? Hey, Kari, you're her greatest friend. Can you apologize for all of us? No. I think both of you should go. It was your idea, Anko. I was just trying to make her laugh. We should all go. Each of us is guilty for keeping quiet and not even warning her. If you all want to be friends, we all need to act like it. Exactly. You stuck with us, so you're an accomplice. What? Okay, let's go. We spent the next few minutes searching uh, the entire onsen, but no one saw her. We found Anna in the parking lot, searching for something in the back seat. Anna. Anna. She continued ignoring Anna. us. Nothing changed. Anna, the girls came out to apologize. She stopped and glanced in my direction. But you were with them, and you carry too. I know, and I'm really sorry, Anna. I should never have agreed to this. Don't you like it here? I mean, the worm thing was really stupid. I see that now. But aren't you having any fun at all? Yeah, I'm having a blast when I'm not with any of you. Yukari fell to her knees in shame, clutched her hands over her chest. I'm so sorry, Anna. Please forgive me. I didn't mean anything by it. After her, Anka fell on her knees and then Haruka. Forgive us. We are all guilty. And we'll never do anything so stupid ever again. After the girl spoke, Anna watched me with a cold, unemotional gaze. She didn't blink, didn't flinch, just waited until I fell. I finally fell on my knees and bowed before her. Please, Anna, I would. I would be most grateful if you would forgive me too. When you're all in such a position, it's a lot easier to get along with all of you. Ah. Okay, okay. I forgive you all, but just don't hug. Haruka jumped on Anna with a large hug. Don't hug. Uh, Yukari also went in for a hug, but Anko didn't seem to mind. Ordinarily, Anna would have pushed them away, but it seemed that just for a moment she could tolerate a few hugs from her friends. Can I? No, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> Pouts. Afterwards, we talked in the room before leaving uh, to play a few games of cards. And each of us forgot to ask what Anna was looking for in the card. She's probably looking for a gun. <laughs> or a knife. But to shoot you guys. Stab you guys up. We sat, uh, we sat in Uncle Nikari's room. Uh, which wasn't very big, but offered a beautiful scene of yeah, scene of the gardens with the windows wide open. The mixture of the four shampoo fragrance fragrances drove me crazy, but I kept focus. In the room was pretty, in the room was pretty chill, and the final game came to the logical conclusion. Okay. Wait, how do you play this? Yukari, can you look and see if I have a good hand? I can't look at them. We are opponents! <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Haruka swayed from side to side and made perplexing, perplexed glant, grimmers? Grimances? What? Okay. Maybe it helped her think, but it wasn't like her. Uh, most likely she played for the first time even though she denied it. Uncle didn't say a word. 
say a word throughout the whole game. She clearly wanted to win. It needed only one more good hand for her victory. Haruka, can you stop moving, please? You're distracting me. <clears throat> Anna, as usual, sported her perfect poker face, revealing nothing that would give away her position. Yukari was confused. The entire game simple, too complicated for her to enjoy. Yukari was confused. The entire game was simply too complicated for her to enjoy, okay. <clears throat> and the cards in my hand showed I'll be the winner in the final game, unless... Wither? What? Unless... Wither a... What? Wither a miracle happened? Weather? Wither? <laughs> Unless a mir just I don't know why the wither wither weather like <laughs> I hate it here. <laughs> Alright, unless a miracle happens, or play along with Anna, play along with Hukar, or, uh, hmm. Play along with, uh, Haruka. She's playing like a naive child. Where are all her tricks and cunning? Psst. Haruka, I will switch towards her. She keeps her focus intensely on her cards. Hey, you need to take this card for me. I have my cards. Oh God, take this card. Um, okay. <laughs> what are you two talking about over there? Keep it silent, I let her take my cards. Okay, now what? Say I won. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I win. Okay, I win. Show it. Here you go. Okay, unfold air cards are real. A winning combo. Now what? Now what? <laughs> End of the game. Congrats! Yay! Give me a hug. <laughs> jumping on, uh, jumping on. Yukari, Haruka band to tickle her and laugh. Hold on, I'm coming. Uncle jumped on both the girls with a smile. It was something amazing, something I'd always imagined, like some beautiful moving painting. Surprisingly, Anna also glanced at them with a smile, but the moment she caught me watching, lifted her chin to remind me of her superiority. <laughs> Someone pulled at my hand. Let's go. I owe you a thank you. Cargo led me towards the corridor. With determination. <clears throat> Finally, that stupid game is over. I was never very good at cards. <laughs> but you won. Isn't that cool? She smiled in silence, but it was obviously the cards didn't interest her. Well, what's going on in your mind? I helped you win, so what do I get? My undying gratitude. <laughs> I don't know why you would take it so seriously, but I do appreciate your help. You're just the cutest thing. Why do you think I helped you? Honestly, I'm not sure. She says really short. What? You don't- You're not even saying your own lines. I'm, I'm like- <laughs> I sat here and paused. I was like, she's gonna say really, right? <laughs> it just says honestly, I'm not sure. It just- You're the first person who You're cared the so first okay. person who's cared so much. I've noticed it several times already and it's surprising. I feel really good, but also confused. If that makes sense. Yeah, I think I understand. Well, I'd better go, but we'll talk again later. What's with this later? Okay, be careful. 
Haruka can go from innocent to naive to sentimental very quickly. It explains a little more about her personality smiling at me. She walked out into the street. After the game, we returned to our rooms. The chairs had left our... What? The chairs had left our backs numb from playing, so it was great to finally enjoy a relax enjoy the relaxation of a bed. During a trip, I noticed some weird, something weird. I lost almost all interest in panties. I didn't have a wild desire to peek through or steal panties. It was a wonderful, strange metamorphosis, but I couldn't explain what had come over me. But why? Why suddenly was this happening earlier? I hadn't earlier. I hadn't even bothered to try to know the girls. My focus was fixated on sending the panties, and suddenly at the onsen we sudden, uh, onsen we spoke, and we were sharing stories, laughing and learning and playing cards. In essence, we become we began communicating on a personal level. It was like coming. What? It was like what? It was like coming a beautiful oasis of ha what? It was like coming a beautiful oasis of happiness in a desert. I guess coming upon a beautiful oasis. Okay. It was like coming up. Okay, I'm just gonna read it. Well, like it says, coming a beautiful oasis of happy oasis. Oasis of happiness in a desert of despair. Like I'd found a kind of garden of Eden and was trusted to be its gardener. I still think panties are beautiful and intimate and seductive, that they will always be a special part of the girls and. But does it make sense to live this paradise of life and love and happiness for something so trivial? Beauty will save the world and me what as the well. Hell? Oops, sounds like something was wrong in paradise. The door opened. All four girls rushed into my room without so much of a hello. Anko, uh, Anko? Yeah, uh, I forgot. I, I don't know. Anko approached me boldly and grabbed me by the collar before I could even stand from the bed is always she angry she's angry and not playing not playing Have around you decided to take revenge for your loss in the game huh what are you talking about you knew where our panties <clears throat> were there aren't any perverts around but you what uncle we know he isn't guilty did you forget what happened at our house did panties disappear at your house too huh what a coincidence. What? No. This bastard was holding my panties and trying to get away with it. What? Well, it's obvious he stole our panties. What? Wait, how do you know that it's me? Did you know... Did you know Anna also likes pan? Anna steps up and punches me in the stomach. But maybe it wasn't him. Who knows? Anna, you're acting strange. Why didn't you let him finish talking? Oh, he was just going to say something stupid. That I like pancakes. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I say we let the thief reveal himself right now. Let's resolve this peacefully. I agree. Me too. Show yourself, thief. What are you thinking? Of course it's him. Who else do you expect? It's the old man. Wait, I have an alibi. Oh, yeah? How will you prove it? Well, I need to think and I need to think and I need some time. You can call me guilty uh whenever you want, but I need to prove my innocence. Maybe it was one of or you. Maybe it was that suspicious filthy old man who runs the place. He's been drunk and sleeping for a while now. If no one wants to admit to theft, then I suggest we find our lost panties and appoint a chief investigator. I agree with Yukari. She has a Fine. point. All right. Also, I want to be... <laughs> I want to be the investigator. Yeah, unless you've forgotten, sweetie. 
You're the main suspect. No can do. But maybe I'd be a good fit. We remember your tricks. You're just as bad as he is when it comes to trust. I vote for Yukari. She's the most responsible person here. I agree. Me too. Yukari it is. Yukari looked rather happy that she was trusted enough to be the investigator and to have such a task search out a thief with a hunger for women's panty. Okay. <laughs> okay, I can do this. Feels like we're in some kind of role playing game right now. Quiet, Mr. Suspect. <laughs> what, Yukari? <laughs> Yukari giggled at the power trip went to her head. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here and find some clues. It's frustrating to admit that I have no alibi. Needing to breathe, I walked along the corridors and get some water before returning to my uh, to the room, trying to uh, prove myself innocent. And this situation is going to be very problematic. None of the girls trust me, of course. So there's another issue. Who's guilty? If you ask me, I put my money on Haruka or Anko. Haruka likes to uh, likes pranks, and Anko loves to alienate. Not like anyone's going to listen to me. But wait, maybe it was Anna. <coughs> or Anna? 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 Maybe it was Anna. <laughs> After all, she also is a pantsu hunter. Could she also have an alibi that could keep uh, them from suspecting her? While thinking, I accidentally lost track of my whereabouts and walked into one of the girls' room. As soon as I realized my mistake, I, my mistake, I know I'm in trouble if anyone finds me. Turning to leave, I hear footsteps heading this way. Without, uh, without a choice, I immediately dash for the closet and hid inside. Are you sure you hid them well? Yeah, no one will find them. What? Is that Anna and, and uh... Haruka? Oh, really? Crap. She's heading right for me. And what's that? Why are these pink panties sticking out right here? Uh, these are very cute and also stand out so anyone would notice. Oh. He's too obvious. Wait, or is that he or she? Oh, she's too obvious. <laughs> you got me into this. But you need to learn everything to keep your butt out of trouble. Do you understand? With a sharp movement, Anna... Yanked, okay. With a sharp movement, Anna yanked the panties uh, from the door gap. Thankfully, the door didn't even stir, and they didn't reveal me as they came free. I know the better place to hide everything. Let me show you. Awesome. Sounds perfect. Okay, they're gone. Wow, those two are dangerous, but I won't be able to figure out this case without doing some investigation on my own. Should I follow Wait. them? I think someone might be in the closet. Oh, I doubt that. No, we have to check it out. Oh great, this is the end of me. Even if I hoped it <laughs> hoped it wouldn't, the closet door swung well, open. Oh well. What do we have here? Oh no way, how could you? Oh sorry, I got confused and slipped into the wrong room. And what's under here? <laughs> Stolen panties. Yes, stolen by you two. What happened in here? You got into the room after the racket. Look at it yourself. Um. <laughs> no, it's not what it looks like. I'm, <laughs> I'm in the wrong room. They stole oh, these. Be quiet. You're in a closet with all the stolen panties. I don't think they need to know anything else. Yeah, but he's such a cute pervert. What? Gosh, this is so terribly unfair. <laughs> this 
despite the injustice, life remained beautiful though because I was in a circle of four nymphs surrounded by surrounded by which the beautifully stirred sky appeared like something truly unreal. Or maybe that's just flies before my eyes. I don't know. I don't care. All I know is my mind is seeing the impossible and everything around me. It's around me is stunning. I want to be here forever. This trip was absolutely the most amazing of my life and I wonder if I'll ever see another that even begins to match. At least while I was in the girls closet I was able to enjoy seeing all the girls beautiful sexy and adorable panties at once. <laughs> Fortunate man. <laughs> what? what? 